Welcome to this round of the competition. This game really could go either way. Both squads are packed with talent and experience. Justin Marshall for Royal Black joins me here. Electric atmosphere here, Justin. Thanks a lot, Nisbo. Big match up for sure. We're about half capacity in this match. Definitely a few empty seats around the place. Well, I'd expect a close one here. It may come down to one mistake or a moment of brilliance to swing it one way or the other. It should be a good game of rugby. So, a lot to look forward to in this game. So, we're about to get going. Dropped in a short kickoff. Kickoff nicely taken in. Yeah, he took a great catch. He was under all sorts of pressure too, but he handled it well. Flicks a short pass. Molly lays it back. Brody Rattel finding top gear. The second rower takes it nicely. He spreads it. There's some real force in this defence. Here's an intercept. Release. Back to his feet quickly and wrestling for the ball. Piranara pulled release. down there. Ruck is formed. He has to release. No way through. A good pass to his support player. The back rower sells the little dummy. And the penalty comes. Well, it looked high to me, and the ref agreed too. So, they'll take the penalty, and that's definitely a difficult position to kick from. McKenzie to kick for goal now. Now the kick, sailing towards the uprights. There's three points off what was a pretty tricky kick. That's the start they would have been looking for. And the kickoff is made here. Kickoff dragged down. Taufua brings him to the ground nicely. Good, strong run. Lani stretching out. Ranger brings it up over halfway. He's nearly there. What a... And he's in. This is what happens from constant pressure. They continue to probe the line, and they've come away with a great result. Outstanding try. I've been impressed with everything he's done in this match. It was a beautifully timed run, and the gap, well, it just opened up. There's a shot at goal to come. So, looking to add an extra two here. Still some work to do with this kick, though. The kick looks good. So the kickoff is made. Kickoff taken in. What a good catch. They were coming up fast. He pushes it on. And he sells the dummy. The crowd are willing him on with this run. Very good defence here. It's a good chance to get some points here. Perfect opportunity to try something. They've got themselves into a position to take some points. Sopoanga looking to score here. 
Hiranara keeps the ball moving. The front rower is nailed in that one. Squire gets it down right under the posts. Well, that was simply outstanding work. Excellent build-up and a great finish. Sopoanga has the conversion. This should turn into an easy seven points with the conversion. The flags are up, and the score now 10-7. So with that, the gap closes right up, and they would have to favour their chances to get ahead. Here's the kickoff. The kickoff snapped up. Did well though, didn't he? It was a very good catch under pressure. Crowd enjoyed that tackle. Somehow he's managed to grab that back. The back rower gathers it out of the back. White block delivers it to a runner. And he's driven backwards now. And he loses some ground there. Sends a good pass. The right winger with a running opportunity again. Good opportunity here. Shut down with a brutal tackle. Yuani keeps it going. Probing run towards the line. He's over. Well, what a scintillating attack. Yeah, he's done very well there. Breaks away, and then no one could catch him. Simply too fast. Bang on, Justin. and the conversion to come. And you'd have to say, two more easy points coming here for Tasman. No trouble with that, two more points. Yeah, this guy is superb. That's a handy lead they've got now. Sopoanga with the restart. Owen Franks snaps up the kickoff. Some great catching skills. Short run through to his support player. Defender fails to take him down. Good work by the players in the ruck. Still their ball. Advantage. Forward pass, not a good one. And they'll come back for the scrum. He'll be really disappointed with himself there. An unforced error. Crouch. Bind. Set. Good strong hit. And a good battle going on here. Solid scrum and the ball's out. Halfback takes the ball. Squire brings it up to halfway. He's been hit hard. The ball's being contested. Brody Retellick picks up and runs. Nice tackle, but not before he made plenty of ground. They need to tighten up their defence. Just too many holes. Too many players being let through. Ball is ready now. Good run here. Breaks the first tackle. Possible turnover here. 
Weber hands it back. He gets it off to the support. That's a lovely kick for touch. 17 points to seven. At the break here. Not the biggest crowd, but they're a lively lot, so don't expect a quiet one. Bit of an untidy match so far, Justin. The interesting thing is the stats, Nisbo. They've persisted with this tactic of controlling territory. We can see they've been good at stringing their phases together. Good ball control so far. A low number of turnovers in that half. There are some good areas and some things to work on. Standing by for the referee's whistle to get us back underway. Short kickoff here. Taylor takes in the kickoff. McKenzie is having a go with the ball. The open side flanker finds support. The number 11 with a long run. Sopoanga on a searching run. And that's a try beautifully executed. Just showed great pace there to score the try. He only needs a little space to work with. Absolutely exceptional try. Well, they've been absolutely outstanding, haven't they? Yeah, he's done very well there. Breaks away, and then no one could catch him. Simply too fast. Kick it, goal still to come. Very important conversion here. Successful conversion, 17-14. They know they've got a chance to win this game. Kenzie gets us going again. Kick off, drag down. Taufua makes the tackle. The ball there now. Inside with that pass. Stop. He's trying to turn it over quickly. That'll knock the wind out of him. Strong driving defence there. Now they get there. They've turned it over. Beautifully done getting players there a little more quickly and they managed to turn it over. And he's shaken up by that one. Ball's being contested. Advantage. Looked like a forward pass. The crowd certainly thought so. The referee has pulled them up. They'll go back for the scrum. Yes, things falling apart there, Nisbo. A bit untidy, crowd. really. Bind. They're all looking for holes in that defence. Let's Set. see what they can do. Both teams putting pressure on Furious looking scrum down there. Ball's out here. That's the ball out there. Probing run towards the line. The opportunity to score here. Oh, and a penalty right on their own line. And that's a bad mistake from Tuiava. Well, that was dangerous play. So they're going to kick for touch, not going for three. And that's a line out. One against the throw. Now this is a more. And it's there now. Sopawanga pushes through. Strong running. And he's banged it into touch. So this is a line out. The number five is the target. Nice work at the line out. Couldn't agree more. It's taken down on a hard tackle. A good pass to his support player. Milner Scudder wanting some support. That'll knock the wind out of him. And they drive him backwards. They have got numbers here. Weaver grabs it out of the back. Back inside. 
anybody's ball here. Very nimble on his feet there. And he's pounded into the ground. They've got more players at the breakdown here. Squire is absolutely smashed. Back to his feet quickly and wrestling for the ball. He turns it back on the inside. Hiranara dragged down Release. in a nice tackle. He's having a go at the ball. Ball goes inside. Bekatoa makes a good burst. Now they drag him down. And it looks like it might be a turnover. Stolen ball, turnover. Built some pressure, and they turned the ball over very well. Milner Scudder, he a dangerous runner. And that held this ball perfectly. The lock delivers it to a runner. Spins it on. Back he goes. He's trying to turn it over quickly. Yuani gets the ball to his support player. Jinks his way past. They might still have it. He spreads it. <laughs> Molly reels him in. Well, there lies the problem, really. The inability to cover at the right time. Oh, they've only got a few minutes to make something. The number seven finds a teammate. He's been hit hard. Back to his feet quickly and wrestling for the ball. Now flat. Perinara gets a bit of steam up. Shut down with a brutal tackle. They take their time getting there. Squire is absolutely smashed. Still there, I think. Himopo picks it up. There's a go at the defence. And he's knocked down hard. He's having a go at the ball. He takes it past halfway. Over the line it goes. Himopo dragged it down nicely, trying to get a drive going here. The ball controlled at the back, able to find the supporting player there, steps back inside and beats the tackler. Taken on by the tight head prop. The number seven gets the ball to his support player. Release. Ruck is formed. He has to release. Hiranara gets it away. Himopo driven release. backwards. The ball's being contested. Squire gets some speed up. The scrambling defence get him at the end of the run. Hiranara finds a runner. Crunch to ground. He's trying to turn it over quickly. He's been hit hard. Weber stops him. Sam White has it out the back. Inside pass. Strong defense. Interception! And he's shaken up by that one. Back he goes. No way through there. And penalty. He'll be frustrated with themselves for giving that one away. He'll look to find touch. The kick finds the line. And the arms are raised as they take the victory. Tasman, the winners over Bay of Plenty. Tasman will be happy to walk away from the game with the lion's share of the points. Some stunning rugby we've had here. They simply miss far too many tackles, giving too many opportunities away. They couldn't hold on to the ball well enough. Thanks for joining us. We'll look forward to seeing you next time.